हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल आई विल बी टेलिंग यू दैट हाउ टू मेक गिटहब यूजर कार्ड्स एंड रेपोजिटरी कार्ड्स यूजिंग गिटहब एपीआई इन रिएक्ट जेएस सो लेट मी जस्ट शो यू द डेमो ऑफ द एप्लीकेशन दैट वी विल बी बिल्डिंग हियर सो दिस इज अ लाइव डेमो यू कैन सी हियर यू कैन जस्ट हैव गिटहब यूजर नेम यू जस्ट नीड टू प्लग द यूजर नेम ऑफ द यूजर नेम दैट यू वॉन्ट टू मेक द कार्ड हियर सो द कार्ड वुड लुक लाइक दिस सो इफ यू क्लिक दिस it will redirect you to the github page of the user where you can just have all the information regarding that user so this is a simple card that you can embed on on your website so here you just need to plug the username of the github username let me just plug this on my username which is gauthi123456 as i plug this username and you will see as i refresh it you will see my information is grabbed here 96 repository 51 followers so all this information will be automatically grabbed by this help of this component library which is i am using inside react js so you can also choose the theme as well you can switch to medium theme as well so if you switch to medium you will see this beautiful looking theme is applied to this this component automatically and here you can just have your any repository you can embed it let me just click on any of my repository here so you will see i can just have this repository if i want to so the address will be simply we like here if you click on the repository this is the portion that you just need to copy paste so simply copy this portion and uh, you need to paste this here inside this paste and now if i refresh you will see this is your repository you can just switch to default like this so all the source code regarding this application will be there inside my video description i have written a complete step by step blog post on my website the link of the blog post will be there inside video description so all the source code is there inside video description so just go to it and follow along with the video so this is a step by step blog post also the live demo is also there so you can just click this link and go to it it will redirect you to the same page and now to get started first of all you need to install this uh, you can uh, directly clone this uh, git uh, github link here just so by this git command you can cd into it and just start your application or if you want to i have also given the github link as well download source code so you can just go to this official repository here this is the component official github repository so here we inside my blog post i have written step by step instructions so first of all we will be building this application from scratch you need to install this library react dash github cart so this is the name of the library so for building the react js application i will make use of uh, a very simple code sandbox.io this is my favorite website for building react angular vue js application because in local development it takes a lot of time to install to instantiate a new react js project if you don't have a uh, a nice computer so you can just go to this website and create a new sandbox just sign up for a new account you can even sign up with the uh, google account or github account so now i will make a new react js template so it will instantly create your react js project so it will hardly take 5 to 10 seconds after installing all these you can see this is my brand new react js project so nothing is there now so here this is the nice thing about it you can add any sort of dependency by clicking this button so i will search for this dependency which is react dash github dash cards so you will see in auto complete it will show this dependency react github cart so simply you need to select this and automatically it will install it in the background you will see this animation going on now the library is installed here you can see it is appearing here now the thing we need to do is that you need to just go to my blog post i have written this snippet of code so here you just need to copy to clipboard simply copy this snippet of code and here you need to make this just paste it inside app.js so whatever app.js file simply delete this and paste it so here what we it happen here you will see so here you just need to replace your own username so it is transpiling the modules here and you will see my username is appearing and also my uh, repository is also appearing here so you can just change the theme uh here i am using the medium theme so we are using slash medium slash medium dot css so if you want to uh, use the traditional theme 
you can switch this so I can just comment this line here so uncomment comment this if you want to use the default one you can just uncomment the previous two lines that's it so now it will use the default theme which is available so it will install the dependencies and now you will see it will it, it is using this uh, uh, let me just see the documentation is uh, so you just need to go to this let me just paste it here so we need to just change this to default.css so whatever is there you can see you need to change this from uh, medium.css so just need to change to default.css so two themes are available one is default and second is medium so now you can see we have switched at this is the default theme which is appearing here you can see it has got the follow button as well and this is got the followers as well repositories you can also follow this user as well so simply so simply you can embed this component library inside your website also so a very handy library so all the source code regarding this react.js application will be there inside video description i have explained it step by step instructions so if you have any sort of doubt you can go to the video description and go to this blog post to download all the source code so this was all the tutorial guys how to embed a nice user card nice user github card which will show your personal information and also your github repository information as well in react.js so thanks very much for watching this video if you like this video then please hit the like button subscribe the channel and do check this website which is called as freemediatools.com so it contains 180 tools regarding audio image and video so please check out this website and as well and i will be seeing you in the next video until then thank you very much